Hi everyone, my name is Zhang Kaichang. Today I'm going to present our interstage paper called End-to-End -end Integration of Speech Recognition, Speech Enhancement, and Self-Supervised Learning Representation. This work is done with the help from Takashi, Yuya, and Shinji. Recently, self-supervised learning is very popular. Various of self-supervised learning models for speech were proposed. Applying those SLRs in many downstream speech understanding tasks shows great performance. In the ESPNet toolkit, many use cases support this, including ASR, SLU, speech translation, etc. However, Many SSR models are pre-trained on clean speech, which limits their applications. Many models, such as the APC, Mocking G, Wiv2Vec, Wiv2Vec 2.0, and Hubert, are trained either on Libri speech or Libri Lite, which are clean red speech. The consequence is that such methods brings more improvement on clean speech input against the noisy speech input. This table is taken from our previous paper, showing the ASR performance on various benchmark datasets. Generally speaking, using Hubert or Wiv2Vec 2.0 as SSR brings improvements. Let's just focus on the results on Chime 4 and Water Journal Copra, two rows marked in red rectangles. Yeah, just a, a note, Chime 4 contains noisy speech utterances, but the underlying speech utterances are similar as those in the Wall Street Journal. So the results are quite different. There is a large gap in the absolute performance uh, and the relative improvement against the conventional F-Bank features. For the clean uh, speech in Wall Street Journal, this uh, absolute performance are quite good and the relative improvement against the F-Bank feature models are quite large. That's not the case in the Chime 4 uh, dataset. We know that noisy speech recognition is a difficult task. One common approach in previous studies is to use the joint training of speech enhancement and ASR. The benefits comes in many folds. We can do end-to-end -end training minimize the artifacts introduced in the SE model, reduce the mismatch between the ASR model and the enhanced speech, thus overall improve the performance. One recent important SSR model is a WIVRM. The training data contains the noisy speech input. From the experiments in the original paper, there's no doubt that WIVRM can handle the noisy speech However, is it enough to handle all noisy speech input? There might be more complicated noisy environment than what is used in pre-training. In this case, uh, it brings the domain mismatch. And can we propose some efficient methods to alleviate this mismatch? To address this issue, we propose an end-to-end -end model that includes a speech enhancement SSR and the ASR model. We call it integrated speech recognition with enhanced speech input for self-supervised learning representation or IRIS. During the forward and backward processes, the data or gradients goes through all the modules. In this work, we mainly use WIVLM as the SSR model choice. In the training, we keep the parameters of the SSR model fixed and allow the gradients to be backpropagated through it. Here is the experimental setup. For training, we use both the Chime 4 and the Wall Street Journal datasets. We use a comp testnet structure as a speech enhancement model and the transformer-based joint CTC attention encoder decoder as the ASR model. In our initial setup, the training of the whole model is unstable if we initialize the parameters randomly. 
So we perform the initialization training step to initialize the speech enhancement and the ASR modules individually. We use, in this case, we use the simulation part from CHIME4 to pre-train the SE models. And we use the CHIME4 and Wall Street Journal data together to initialize the ASR part. Later, we fine-tune the whole model using the CHIME4 and Wall Street Journal together. Here are the results for single-channel CHIME4 ASR performance. In the first table, we only use the ASR model without speech enhancement. We can see that when using the VOM as the SSR models, the result is promising on the test sets, better than the FBank or Hubert-based models and other uh, previously uh, proposed models. Note that systems one to three are based on hybrid ASR models and the rest are based on end-to-end -end ASR models. Next, we also include the speech enhancement module. We compare the systems using FBank features and the WebLM SSR input. The ablation study is carried out on evaluating whether we fine tune the speech enhancement module or the ASR module. From this table, we can observe that fine tuning leads to better performance. Fine tuning the SE front end is more important than the ASR part. This is consistent in both FBank feature based and the WebLM based models. If we fine tune them both, the best performance can be achieved. At the end, fine tuning both SE and ASR using the WebLM feature based model results in the best performance. It is far better than the FBank feature based models. Here we list several previously proposed SOTA models using the single channel, two channel, and six channel input. We can see that our proposed model is very promising. It is even comparable to the Chime 4 Challenge best two channel results marked in the rectangular in the in blue color. Here is a figure that shows the WER at different fine tuning steps. It shows an interesting result that fine tuning for only one epoch is already very good. It is enough to handle the most of the cases. While fine tuning for 10 epochs and the average models has the best performance. We also showed the accuracy of different model setups, including the SSR ASR model and the iris, but the parameters are randomly initialized and some fine tuning setups like fine tuning the speech enhancement model, only fine tuning the ASR model, or we fine tune the speech enhancement and ASR both. We can see that if we initialize the S, uh, speech enhancement or the ASR models, then they can or reach a fair accuracy during fine tuning. And if we fine tune both SG and ASR, this results in the best accuracy. It is better than the randomly initialized models, which couldn't achieve a, a satisfactory accuracy in the end. This conclusion is consistent with the final ASR performance that we showed before. Okay, here's a conclusion. We propose IRIS model that performs uh, an end-to-end -end model of uh, combining the speech enhancement, self-supervised learning representation, and the automatic speech recognition models. We found that speech enhancement front-end can improve the robustness of the self-supervised learning representation model against the noise. This also indicates that we need better methods or SSR models to handle the noisy speech. But this also introduced a new possibility of applying the speech enhanced models for the multi-channel input uh, to, to be used as the input for the self-supervised learning representation model.
we achieved the new sorted results on single-channel CHAM4 ESR task. In our future plan, we want to extend this to multi-channel input and apply it on more challenging data set, such as CHAM6. Thank you all for watching this video. If you have, if you have any questions or comments, please uh, come to the Q&A session.